What's up guys, it's your boy Metroaptor, also known as Luxatus Patella. Welcome to another part of my Disney's Tarzan action game HD revamp walkthrough series. Last time we did some shenanigans on the boat, we killed some enemies with our knife, and well, yeah, we just completed it 100% of course, and now we're gonna do the second to last level of this game, and shit's about to get real serious again, because Tarzan has to go to the rescue this time. So yeah, without further ado, let's get to it. So as usual, I show you this status screen. We have achieved 100% in all the previous levels. Let's go do the second to last one. Let's hope it's another 100% run. So yeah, let's do this. This is one of those special levels. Instead of walking from left to right, we actually have to go straight on. And the first scenario we encounter is of this rhino who is bumping into some crates. And yes, each of these crates has some content in them, which is quite strange because when you stand on top of them, they don't really shake, and normally this was an indicator back in previous levels at the camp. So yeah, it's, I, f I find it to be a little bit strange, but still, content. Uh, but they're really stingy on special fruit, I think. No, it's this one then. This one should have some special fruit. Yes, and that's the only special fruit that you will get in this level, so good luck. After this, let's get the mango, let's jump over this. And then we have the next segment. Now we have the knife. And we can swing the knife because as you can see on the top of the screen there are some bats. Now we have killed bats before with the knife and we could actually jump over the pit. The bats will come at us. We can swing the knife to try and kill them. But I think it's actually better to just try and outrun them because you can jump over this pit keep running and then at some point the bats will stop pursuing you which I think is a better solution so let's do that so there are two pits just jump over them there are four bats chasing us but they will start pursuing me and yeah same section here there are bats there's also a killer croc who is defending a letter but I've just managed to get it the bats stop pursuing me and we still have no damage and we are already at the third save point I think Whew. Now we're gonna have the section with Tantor. And this section is quite chaotic, but we can steer Tantor from left to right, and we also have to duck uh, from some branches with Tarzan. And we also have to get, collect uh, some letters, and we have to destroy things. It's just, it's for the, I don't know, 22nd or 32nd ride, it's just a madness. But let's go and try and do this. So, yep, we're gonna smash some things, cause some destruction, we have to duck, get the collectible, rock around these pits, because otherwise you will die, those are traps. Same thing, if you forget to duck in time, you will fall off, you will also lose a life. It's just ridiculous. And then there are the flares, everything turns red. I think that's a pretty amazing effect, and jump over this pit and boom we're at the next section and this is probably the most dreaded section of all because these goons normally the goons were pretty stupid but this time oh boy they throw barrels and crates and rocks at such a rapid pace it's ridiculous you will get so much damage uh, if you don't if, if, if you just don't kill them in time or if you're at the wrong position or you don't have your timing right, it's just gonna be a mess. So I'm actually quite dreading this moment. So what I'm, oh, he's already starting. Well, shit then. Okay, so he's dead. Boom, oh, I just threw that extra fruit. But that doesn't matter because that's always what I do. I have the special fruit, there's only five and I use them on those two goons, which I think is good. I'm gonna get some bananas and then there are two more goons and these will also throw crates at a pretty rapid pace and these also do uh, a lot of damage which is pretty annoying but you know it's the way it is so let's go try and do this though so the way I do this is just, I just jump every time they throw and usually like instead of this one because now the patterns have a bit they're a bit changing um, but it's okay though. Let's see, I hit him, I hit him again. I'm gonna hit by this crate, that's unfortunate. Let's see, one more hit, boom. Okay, so I did, did pretty well. Usually I do a lot worse <laughs> in this section, but uh, we're gonna see. You know, it's pretty hard for me to do a no damage run at this point, but let's continue. Um, then we have this thing. 
So there is this heavy ass crate and no matter if you go left and right, it will always follow you. There's no way to like outrun it or to go through it. Uh, and if you pass, if you try to continue, the crate will drop on you, you will lose a life. And well, that's not really fun. So as a kid, I never knew how to get past this point. I always just sacrificed a life. And then um, afterwards, when you respawn, the crate is gone. So then you can just continue. But of course, this there had to be a way of like making sure that you can actually pass this legitimately. And this is the way to do it. It's a bit tricky, but it's the way to do it. Then we're just going to throw fruit at this guy who is throwing rocks. Nicely done. Let's see if I have everything because I've kind of forgot to check the area. Here we go. We have everything we need. Next save point and the last sketch, I believe. Yes, we do. There is this goon coming who's going to also throw rocks at me. It's just those guys. I don't know what it, what's up with them, but they throw rocks at such a rapid pace. Just look at the amount of damage I already have. It's just ridiculous already. This guy, he probably wants a knife fight, but fuck it. I'm going to use fruit for this. I'm just gonna try and um, smash these two crates and then I have to really be cautious because again this is the same scenario 100% um, with the coins by the way same scenario there is this um, cage and if I want to go through the end of the level he will drop the cage on me and I will die but then again if I respawn then the cage is gone but still it's not the way to do it so again we have to uh, hit him this is the last goon I have to kill and I really have to be cautious here because look at the fucking pace he's throwing his stupid things. One more hit and I'm down. What the fuck? This is really ridiculous. I'm actually quite tense. And he's dead. Whew. Sudden death here, guys. Sudden death. Let's see if I have everything. I do have everything. Let's go and kill Clayton. Clayton, you're gonna die now. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. What What the hell? You're immune to fruit. What is this? What is this? I guess we just have to kill you in the next level. God damn it, Clayton. <laughs> so yes, 100%, 100%. I'm gonna go save it up and I'll see you at the bonus level. More tree surfing! It's amazing. But yeah, more tree surfing. It's basic stuff. You know how it works. And let's see how we're gonna do today. Eh. Let's go to the right, go to the left, more time mangoes and stuff like that. It's just basic stuff. You've seen this many, many times before. Do and I'm not sure if I actually get better at it. I'm actually not sure. I think I still kind of suck with these segments. Because sometimes, yeah, like this, I don't get it. Because I'm pretty sure the obstacle was stale, was still like way, way, way f far away from like when the uh, collision actually happened. Same thing here, but eh, whatever. Let's go. Maybe get 200. We're gonna get 200 coins. Oh, lovely. But it seems I'm gonna run out of time. Ah, what? These coins don't count. That's bullshit. <laughs> but it's okay though, 27 lives, it's more than enough, hopefully, <laughs> for the last level. Let's uh, go to this screen, here we are, 92% completion rate in total, everything 100% so far. The only thing that's left is the final level against Clayton, and after that I'm gonna wrap up the series because this will be the end of, the, of this walkthrough series. But um, not before I do some other extra things as well. But that will be for the for the final part, the, the next part, the final part uh, of this series. So yeah, hopefully uh, you've enjoyed this. So like and favorite if you like the content. Subscribe to our channel, or rake your free from upcoming videos, and I'll see you guys next time for the final episode.